Hey and welcome to the Shave Tank and today I do a little review of two new aftershave splashes that I got and they are both from Fine and one is the Fine Platinum and the Fine L'Orange L'Orange Noir so these are very classic aftershave splashes, also in the way of their ingredients. So there is in there alcohol, water, fragrance, menthol. This means, of course, there are not many things in there that could uh, add to skin uh, stuff, like uh, skincare products. But then the good thing is there are also no artificial colorings, artificial preservatives or anything that could possibly go wrong. So if you're not allergic to the fragrance per se, you're probably good. And due to the alcohol and menthol, it will do the job that the aftershave splash is made for. So that's very, very nice. So very basic, very classic. And I really dig that. So I got already got the two. Um, here in Europe, you can get them from shavingstation.co.uk. Big shout out to Stuart and his awesome customer service because you can also order this from mainland Europe. Shavingstation.co.uk does ship alcohol based fragrances to the mainland. Hooray! Awesome, awesome service. Love it. So now, Let's check it out and the scent of it. Let's open this up, platinum first. This is a really, really classic scent. Actually reminds me of a scent that my dad used when I was really young. Really classic aftershave. Let's put some on. So let me test how it does on the skin. I already shaved. Only used Austrian mountain water. Mmm, very nice. Of course, it has some alcohol kick to it. And some really nice mental freshness. Actually feels really good on the skin. And the scent is really, really refreshing. Really nice and really classic. So, platinum, definitely a keeper for me. Really awesome, classic scent. And now we go for the L'Orange Noir. Of course, I won't put some, put some on because I already put some platinum on. I don't want to mix the fragrances, but we'll whiff it out of the bottle. So. Oops, put some on my lip and we will do this little trick here. Uh, this actually reminds me of two things. Uh, there is a aftershave that you can get in Italy that's only called Noir. And or Nero, Italian, Nero. Uh, and this smells in this direction, but with an orange fruity twist to it. So really, really nice too. I don't know which one I actually find better. Really like both. <laughs> so this scents awesome. And From the scent strength, there is definitely already like cologne-like strength, scent strength to it. And I guess they will hold up also nicely over the day because there are no additives in there or something. So usually with alcohol, just and fragrance, the fragrance will, like in a classic cologne, stay with you at least for a few hours, which is really, really nice. So, fine. I can't put two thumbs up now because I'm holding this, <laughs> but 
but I give it two thumbs up. Really, really nice fragrances. The Platinum and the Lounge Noir. I guess I have to get some more now <laughs> from Fine because those are really, I dig those really. And I really dig that this is very, very classic. Just some basic ingredients and you're good to go. And not much added to it. If you want, you can, of course, put a more or less scentless balm in combination with it. Uh, and you're also good on the skincare properties then. And very, very refreshing. They have a good mental kick, not too hefty. Uh, for example, the Floyd Vigoroso is a little bit more kick, or the Barasso Green, but it's also not as low kick as, for example, the Kalani Mental, which is very, very subtle mental. So, very good kick. And also, a mental aftershave that I also would use in winter. So, really, really dig this way to go fine platinum launch noir and two thumbs up thanks for watching let's all high five and i see you next time